Please welcome Solver and Executive Director and Co-Founder, We Robotics, Patrick Meyer. So Cyclone Pam was a Category 5 cyclone that devastated the islands of Vanuatu in the South Pacific. And I was invited in response to this disaster by the World Bank to coordinate a humanitarian drone mission to help assess the disaster damage. But there were no local drone pilots at the time, so we had to hire foreign drone companies who took weeks to deploy, cost a fortune, and of course we're a bunch of white people. So local community here is holding the umbrella for the local, you know, for the white drone pilot, which really feels completely wrong, right? And since then, the Pacific has been battered by an onslaught of major cyclones, no fewer than four in just the past months alone. So we've teamed up with the University of the South Pacific to help build disaster resilience in the South Pacific. Now you're probably familiar with digital natives. Well, in the Pacific and elsewhere, we're working with drone natives and training them on how to use this technology for a wide range of humanitarian work. These young people are flying drones like this one way before even flying in an airplane. And in the most recent disaster, the most recent cyclone, just a few weeks ago, Ms. Amrita Lal, who coordinates our Pacific Flying Labs, deployed with the Red Cross to the disaster affected areas. And by doing so, Amrita became the first local drone pilot to respond in a major disaster in her own country. And by default, the first woman, the first young person to be involved in humanitarian operations as a drone pilot in the Pacific region. And because she's local, it took her only a matter of hours to deploy, not weeks. Our mission at We Robotics is to localize appropriate robotic solutions, which means localizing the skills needed to empower a young generation of drone natives. So the point here is that there's less and less need and reason for these international organizations like the World Bank, the UN, the Red Cross, to hire foreign companies when they can hire locally. Fact is, demand for these kinds of drone services, robotic services, is increasing. This is the fourth industrial revolution after all. But there's no reason this demand cannot be met first and foremost locally by young professionals like Amrita. And so zero used to be the number of local drone natives who were hired by international organizations in Fiji, in Nepal, Peru, and Tanzania. But ever since launching our flying labs in these countries and other countries, hundreds of local drone natives are finally participating in these projects. Some of them are even leading some of these drone projects funded by international organizations. Now, I want to end on a perhaps more somber note. Um, the fourth industrial revolution, like previous resolution, revolutions before it, is already creating an alarming divide, a divide between the haves and the have-nots, a divide between those who have access to these robotic solutions and those who don't, right? The solutions like drones and uh, the skills they need to participate in the fourth industrial revolution. So yet again, the majority world get le gets left behind. So exactly who gets to participate in this fourth industrial revolution? Well, I'm afraid it's the same usual suspects. Low-income countries are not even on the map of this industrial revolution. They're left behind, and they're already facing a digital divide. And so now with this robotics divide in addition, the inequality is even more exacerbated, right? And so we must and we can correct this technology injustice. How? by providing these young people with the marketable skills they need and the technology access they need to participate fully in the fourth industrial revolution so that they can be hired by international organizations to do meaningful work in disaster response, in coastal management, in public health, and more. And so the next time that the World Bank needs a drone team leader, they better as heck not hire me and hire Amrita and her team of local drone natives. Thank you very much.